What's up everybody, today I'm going to be doing an Essentials Chat tutorial. Now, the two things you'll need um, for this tutorial is permissions installed and a bucket server of course. Click the two links on the screen right now and go watch those videos because they are important and without them, well, you won't be able to use them. Uh, well, use this of course. So, first things first, you're going to need to download this and put the Essentials Chat jar in the as main Essentials jar into your plugins folder as you can see here. I have them in here. Run the server and it'll create an essentials folder. Go in there, open up the config file, and start from there. Now, scroll down from the um, thing because the uh, entire config is for every single plugin they create. So just scroll down until you see this part right da -da -da -ba -ba here. Essentials chat. Now, um, space, go right under this line under the admins and just space over until you're right under the A, like that and type in let's just start with our highest rank although it doesn't matter you can start with your lowest rank mine is admin of course yours would be anything else that you changed it to do a semicolon a space a apostrophe and then we'll just say it'll we'll have our group name first so we'll do a bracket now this is for looks of course and then a minus sign or a uh, uh, slash or whatever you want to call it um, uh, of course, this is for looks. You could put a what an what up an up sign if you really wanted to. It doesn't matter. This is just for looks. So let's just put admin. Now, if we wanted to color, the second page you're going to have to open up is this one. Um, at the bottom of this page, it'll be in the description as well. Um, just scroll down, and then you'll see all of these. So we're going to make ours um, red. All right. So let's just go here and. Four. So what we do is the and sign, and then four, and that will make admin red. And um, if you wanted, like, say, half of it to be red, and then the other half to be another color, let's just make it the other half purple, which is and five. So and five, and then the i n, and then whatever else we have after that until we change it will be purple. All right. So let's do another dash and a closing bracket just for the sake of sakes. Now let's go ahead and do our display name. So our display name will have, let's see, what other fancy colors do we have here that I could implement? Um, let's do dark green, um, which is and2. So we'll go in here and change it to and2. Uh, put a bracket in just for looks, but this next part is not for looks. It's actually necessary. So we're going to do a mustache bracket, which is shift and then the bracket. Um, I don't know the official term for it, but it's good enough for me. Mustache bracket, it's pretty cool. Um, and then in all caps, write display name, oh, display name, and then close it with another uh, mustache bracket, of course, the other side. And then for looks, we'll put another bracket, and then we'll throw in some dashes in there just because we're keeping about what the admins is, was. And uh, there you go. And two. And just to make sure, sometimes after this little code, it will cut off this color, and it, by default, it will be white. So, um,. Just for the sake of sakes, oh, I don't know why I did that. Um, we'll just put in another and two just to be safe. And of course, the and two won't show up. It's only the color, so it'll ignore it and put in the color. Um, all right, then we'll do another space, and let's just have our message now. So actually, let's backspace and do a semicolon, um, and then do a space, and then do another mustache bracket. This time, we're not going to have a bracket there because during the message, you don't want a bracket in there. And then just all caps message, and then another mustache bracket, and there you go. We have done the admin successfully, except we have to do another apostrophe at the end to keep the. It, it pretty much means you're starting and you're ending a line of pretty much code. It's probably the simplest code you could ever possibly think of, but it's still code in a way. All right, next line. We are going to do our mod, which in my case is just mod, or moderator, or whatever it is on your channel. Do a space do another apostrophe and then for color let's just do blue which is nine I believe double check right here yep nine so and nine and then um, a bracket just for looks like I said dash um, let's just type mod dash brackets space our next color which we'll just keep um, uh, blue and you always kind of want to do another color thing right after a space just to be safe and also after a code because every once in a while it'll bug out and you'll see white after a certain part and you don't want it to be there so you're like god dang it so you do that 
you know, it doesn't really matter, but it's it won't show up in the actual chat, so you might as well. Alright, so we'll do a bracket, a dash, a uh, mustache bracket, display name, uh, another mustache bracket, dash, or whatever you want to call it, bracket. And uh, then we'll do a semicolon, because the, the semicolon doesn't have to be there. It's just kind of indicating that the message is starting. Of course, it can be whatever you really want it to be. Uh, mustache bracket, message, wait, message, and then um, another mustache bracket. All right. And then, of course, you drop a um, apostrophe. So I'm going to go ahead and pause the video. And uh, no, actually, I'll just continue forth, and I'll teach you as much as possibly you can fit in your brain at one time. Next line, scroll over to uh, what are what is our next one? Let me check my because uh, I don't want to put in too many here because that'd be bad and um, we'll get an error. Uh, we have oh member okay member. So let's do member um, semicolon space apostrophe. Our color let's just do something we haven't used. Let's do pink and um, actually. Purple's kind of cool. Um, uh, what do you guys think? Of course, I no, no. Let's do something crazy. Dark teal. No one ever uses dark teal. Of course, now you're probably what is what did I just uh, E3 trail? No, I didn't click on an E3 trailer. I'm still back here. Okay. Um, what 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 was it? Let's see. I accidentally clicked on an ad apparently. Uh, what are we doing? Dark teal. So it's three. All right. So. And three, um, and then we'll do bracket again just for looks. Bracket slash member slash brackets um, space again, like I said, um, to keep just to make sure nothing happens. And three again, or whatever color you want. Um, bracket slash mustache bracket uh, display name. Another mustache bracket dash bracket space. Lots of things going on. Uh, semicolon, space, uh, and then mustache bracket, message, of course, again in all caps. Mustache bracket, and then um, another semicolon. I'm not a semicolon, what am I thinking? Apostrophe to seal it up. Next line, we're going to be doing our um, basic or our default um, thing. So, space, apostrophe to start the line. Um, we're going to leave this a blank, so white is default, so we're not going to do anything. But if you did want to change something midway, it would be and F is the color for white, but we don't need to change that. So um, bracket slash basic slash bracket space, and we're not going to change it either. So bracket slash mustache display name uh, mustache bracket slash bracket. Uh, and then a semicolon, and then a space, a mustache bracket, a message, and then another mustache bracket, and then an apostrophe. So, there we go. We've configured that. Now all we're going to do is save it, and then we will, first of all, add ourselves to, let's just drop ourselves as a basic first, and then we'll move up, and I'll start the server here in a moment. Run, uh, actually... Before I do that, let me just make sure my whitelist is on true. That way, I don't have any people coming in unwanted because I do run a server off my computer. And since this is port forwarded, we don't want any unwanted fellas coming in here. Now we go into games, Oblivion, of, I mean, you know, Minecraft, whatever. We'll make this full screen and uh, go on to local host. Alright, so we're here in the server, and if it cut off and it looked kind of funny, is because I was having tr problems, um, and I had to turn on my whitelist and all that stuff, but it doesn't matter. It, n no, it does no, it doesn't. Alright, so, here we go. Um, the final test, basic, Tana Pro, hi. Now, I'm going to pause it, put myself to a, uh, what, what's the next one, member, and come back. Alright, we're back, and, uh, now we're going to do, test out our member. So here we go. Let's just type member for the sake. Member, member, member. There we go. Look at that. That is beautiful. It, actually, I like that color. It's not. Uh, it's not too bad. I might actually use that. All right. Now to test out our moderator. So I'll be right back yet again. 
All right, we're back, and uh, let's just go ahead and test out our mod by typing in mod. Tana Pro. All right, so that is a bug that sometimes happens with that little white there. To remedy that, simply go in right before that problem and add another and nine in our case or whatever your color is. Um, that does happen sometimes, and to remedy those things, simply just add that little bit, which I actually, I believe I said you should do, and I didn't do on my mod, um, which is after a command, you should normally put in the color again, because you will have that problem, but of course I didn't do that, because I am an idiot, but that's pretty much it guys, I'm not even going to test my admin, because I'm pretty sure I got the point across that I did these things right, thank you guys for watching this video, if you did like, leave a like, and if this did help you, leave a like, because there's no this did help you button. Although there should be. Yes. Um, also, check out my channel, which is the Angry Panda TV, or my community channel, where you can upload RPG games, uh, game footage, walkthroughs, and let's plays. Um, well, whatever game you like, you can do Minecraft, you can do Terraria. You can do whatever you feel like, except for, you know, anything that has to do with an RPG. Uh, Minecraft and Terraria, I count as RPGs because it's cool. Both links will be in the description. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you fellas and gals in my next video. Peace!